wrestling fans, thanks for clicking the Dreaded D. Rose report. WWE has confirmed the next member of the Hall of Fame of Class of 2011 will be Abdullah the Butcher. WWE's posted video announcing Abdullah's uh, induction on YouTube, by the way. Find it. As previously reported, Chris Jericho made his uh, Dancing with the Stars debut on Monday and has scored a 19 out of 30 points. Uh, better than a lot of the other teams, I guess. Jericho's partner is uh, Cheryl Burke perform the cha-cha which is on YouTube too. You don't know how to cha-cha is because you're not over 50. Uh, previously, uh, let's say, oh, WWE and uh, Viventi Entertainment. I think that's right. Anyway, they announced today that they are extending their relationship as a part of the deal. Walmart will be exclusive uh, retailer of WWE Studio Films. Uh, Viventi Entertainment will continue to be WWE's North uh, American retailer in uh, rental distribution. All right, this exclusive, exclusive deal, by the way, will cover WWE Studios for the next five theatrical uh, releases, which I, I don't know how much they had to pay them to carry their movies, but I know they're gonna, not going to make a fortune off of them. Anyway, it's going to be a runner through 2012. The partnership gives Walmart, Sam's Club, Walmart.com the exclusive right to sell DVDs, Blu-ray version of the films for the first 90 days of their release. The Chaperone, uh, let's see, what else? Chaperone and, um, I don't know. It's going to be the first of the deal, I guess. So, Walmart, I don't know what kind of pricing they're going to do. Uh, Diva Dirt, by the way, reports that uh, WWE Diva Ashley Massaro told a fan at her first Diva Mania event this past Saturday that she has a new reality TV of some sort coming out this fall on Fox. Stay tuned. John Cena noted on his Twitter that he was cut open last night after uh, Raw by, and he was because he was scratched by The Miz. Regarding last night's show also, the on, C on Twitter, Cena says, C Nation, fear in the eyes of the Miz tonight. He says, uh, he now knows WrestleMania won't be a gimme. Rock at uh, Raw next Monday live. Don't miss it. Yes, uh, Miz tried to scratch me. Uh, the tactic uses uh, mostly in cat fights, he says. <laughs> anyway, he was given a haymaker for his efforts. Uh, then he ran. Rock wrote on his Twitter last night uh, about the show and next week's Raw. Says a uh, great ending on Raw. Uh, I promise Raw in Chicago next week will be electrifying like you've never seen before in years. In years, he says. Anyway, for those wondering who, who about the actress that played uh, Randy Orton's wife on uh, Raw last night, uh, that wasn't his wife. That was an actress with a little question mark after actress because man, my wife could have done as good a job as that. She acts quite a bit anyway. All right, uh, former uh, WWE diva Angela Savannah Fong is currently in the running for Maximum's, uh, Maxim's Hometown Hottie Contest, uh, representing Tampa, Florida. Chris Jericho told eOnline.com uh, that his friend and former uh, WWE uh, diva Stacy Keebler has been giving him some advice on uh, for Dancing with the Stars. He says, Stacy's a really good friend of mine, and she's been kind of helping me out a bit. Uh, basically, it's the same thing, that you have to be 100% into it because it's mostly physically, mentally demanding more than anything you'll ever do. Find that hard to believe, but okay. WWE Tough Enough, by the way, Eric uh, Big Nasty Watts is now on Twitter. So if you want to talk to somebody, Big Nasty, he's on there. WWE has invited some fans to purchase access tickets to participating in focus groups to discuss what they do and don't like about the current WWE product. Fans who participate are going to be uh, offered free tickets to the final access session and uh, a private meeting with a WWE superstar. And WWE may not want, like what they hear, which I'm probably pretty sure they won't be liking what they hear. Neil, by the way, sent word that Santino Morella and uh, the Bellas appeared last night on the Cake Boss. Uh, the Bellas smashed Santino with a WrestleMania cake. If anyone uh, got more re recap the show, I'll let you know. 
Anyway, several names were advertised to the Legends Ring. It's uh, Legends uh, Legends of the Ring 12, I guess. It's going to be uh, May 7th, Monroe, New Jersey, at the Crown Plaza. Here's some big names, too. The uh, well, ex-big names and current big names. Jim Ross supposed to be there. Vader, Mike Denae, Dusty Rhodes, DDP. China, Carl Lido, Godwins, Justin Liger, Perry Saturn, Daphne the Cat, Perry Saturn, <clears throat> Paul Bear. I thought he was dead. Rosita, Robbie E, Sonny, Kimono, uh, Stacy Von Eric, Tori Poach, Poch, uh, Virgil, Cherry, and Deuce and Domino. First ever event of uh, at the Console Energy Center in Pittsburgh. Last night was sold out. Not sure how many, uh, you know, tickets or how many seats are there, but uh, it's the first time they've ever been there. John Cena noted on his Twitter that he's racked up around uh, nine million frequent flyer miles and donated them all to the Make a Wish Foundation. Tonight's uh, WWE SmackDown NXT is going to be taking place from the Nationwide Arena, Columbus, Ohio, with one of the final SmackDown shows before WrestleMania 27. As advertised, going to be out real to real. The core taking on Edge, Mysterio, and Big Show. ESPN.com has an article up on Dancing with the Stars, highlighted on the athletes on the show. Chris Jericho, Pittsburgh Steeler, and wide receiver Heinz Ward. Former WWE, CW, rather uh, WWE, WCW, and AWA talent Wayne Bloom. Who's that? Why, it's Bo, Bo Beverly. Celebrates its 53rd birthday today. Bo Be Be Beverly Brothers. Anyway, uh, body uh, restraining the bodyguard restraining Diva Champion Eve from attacking Michael Cole on Raw. If you've seen that, it was independent wrestler Chad Williams. He appears uh, uh, for he uh, wrestles for Absolute Intense Wrestling, a promotion in Ohio. He looked like he was pretty good size, uh, height wise. Anyway. Michael Cole noted on Raw that he's opened up an account on Twitter, which has uh, also been verified. He claims Suit ordered him to open up an account despite his hatreds for the microblogging uh, service. After So Cole does do what he's told, huh? After uh, Monday's episode of Raw, uh, WWE from Pittsburgh went off the air. It was time for the dark match event. CM Punk teamed up with uh, Sheamus, took on John Cena, Triple H. By the way, John Cena wasn't there. How many, raise your hands if you believe that, that he was not there that night when he was said that he wasn't there. He was at home. Do you believe it? Uh, you don't believe it. Anyway, on the heels, uh, uh, Cena, Punk, I mean, uh, rather, the finish came when Cena and Triple H simultaneously uh, and uh, uh, and Cena pinned uh, Punk. Hmm. That sound right? The finish came when S Cena and Triple H simultaneously and Cena pinned Punk. Anyway, that's what it says. It's... Anyway, on the heels uh, of that, they left the ring. Cena and Triple H celebrated for a few minutes before heading to the back. In addition to The Rock uh, appearing on next week's Raw live, WWE's confirmed for uh, tonight's show that Undertaker will be there to accept Triple H's challenge for a face-to-face -face meeting before WrestleMania 27 match. The Rock, John Cena are expected to have their big showdown next week also, so maybe we'll have some big uh, rating points. Per storyline, Alex Riley has been uh, rehired by The Miz to uh, the Raw brand as Vince, uh, or Vice President of Corporate Communications. Anyway, Raw... Uh, Oh, Jim Ross, by the way, uh, on his Twitter account the other day, he responded to Michael Cole's comment about Lawler's, you know, uh, him talking about Lawler's family. I feel so bad for the king. It says both his mom and dad have passed away. Jerry's mom, a few weeks ago, Jerry buried his dad on uh, King's birthday uh, on the 19th. This is, he says, just too much. All right. By the way, Jerry Lawler is going to be teaming with, uh, I think I mentioned that, Matt uh, Riviera to take on uh, the Dark Circle for TCW Tag Team Titles. Uh, April 19th, Fort Smith, Arkansas at the Fort Smith, the Smith Event Center. Before I get tangled up anymore, hey, thank you guys for clicking. I got to go.